I'm doing good at this talking stuff. I'm talking. Wow. Okay, next. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ziggy Sandy, and today I'm going to be talking about different hair gel, uh, edge control, hair tamers, and all of that stuff. I have a bunch of products here with me, and I'm just going to be showing you each and every one of them. I have like 10 products with me, and I'll show you each of them and what I use them for and which one I think you must have in your hair, hair product collection. All right, so I do hope you enjoy this video. Please keep watching and if you like this video, comment, leave a comment, like the video, share, subscribe, and all of that good stuff. Thank you so much and let's continue the video this is the most popular company got to be glue invisible styling gel this has a really strong hold i find this like this you use for if you want to do ponytail any hair size that you have to do a lot of um slick down this is the perfect product for it it has a really strong hold um, I, I wouldn't use this for like everyday use. I wouldn't use this for braiding hair, but I would use this for ponytails, updo type of hair. This is the perfect styling gel. And maybe if you have any hairstyle, maybe curly hairstyle, you have any hairstyle that you wanna, um, you wanna retain the cords for a very long time, you can use this product. I really like this one but not for everyday use next I'm not going in any particular order I'm just picking up whatever you know whatever I pick up I will talk about it so I got this one this was included in my uh, wig um, I bought wig from my first wig no actually I added it as my as an option so when you're buying the wig they have a bunch of product on their website and you can click on which product you want to be included in your wig um, so this was one of them because I've seen a bunch of videos on YouTube and I know that a lot of um, hair stylist youtubers they use this to you know tame flyaways when they do like uh, lace wigs and all of that so when I was ordering my hair I added this to it and this does absolutely great job so you know how when you do your weave wigs and you have those tiny little annoying hair you know sticking out you can just use this to tame it down this is what you use for that and it's not expensive I can't remember how much I paid for it but if you I don't know if other hair companies if they if they have it but I think you can buy it individually from like Amazon and stuff I just added it to my order to you know make it easy for me and next we have um, this one right here it's the touch down first touch down edge tamer maximum 48 hours cherry non flaking you know this is oh yeah I should I should open it for you um, this is what this looks like I just think of can see some hair because I use it all the time when I have wigs this is what it looks like And that's for the uh, flyaway hair tamer and for the got to be glue you know what gel looks like this is what it looks like it has like a liquidy consistency and it's clear um, I know some hair gel had they look black but this one is like uh, clear doesn't have any color and then for the edge control I was talking about, this is what it looks like. This also has clear color, but with um, a hue of uh, 
is it pink or peachy color in it but when you apply it to your hair it's quite clear this i use for edge control um it does hold it a little bit but i find i find this product which i'm going to talk about next this is also hair um edge control i find this one lasts longer than this one um if you're just maybe going for a quick errand and you just need to slick your hair down you know quickly i guess you would use this one but if you want maybe you want it to last all day i would probably go for this product from my personal experience um this one is also good as well yeah it does say 48 hours i find for me once i get in the shower all my edge control goes off i don't really secure it i reapply it the next day so i can't really vouch for the 48 hours but you know quick errands this will work for you so this one is edge booster um stronghold water-based pomade this is also edge control but i've actually used it for my braids um if you watch my um i turned my my old braid to a lux video so that single braid i did it myself and i didn't have any, any uh any of any of this product i'm going to be talking about after i didn't have those product this was the only one close to what i could use um my hair stylist gave me this one but you know it's empty now so i just use this one for that single braid but i find if you use it for single braids it leaves um a white cast on your hair so i wouldn't use it for for braiding hair but i would use it for edge control it does last all day um what does it, it say stronghold water-based pomade yeah it is actually stronghold so i would go go for this one if um if you need edge control and that's what i'm using right now actually that's what i'm using for my hair and it lasts all day it doesn't leave when you use it for hair con um edge control it doesn't leave any white cast but i find when you braid when you use it to braid your hair after a few days you would get white cast so i wouldn't use this for braiding hair i would use it for edge control i'm doing good at this talking stuff i'm talking wow okay next one um i'm gonna save this for the last i'll talk about this last the next one i haven't actually used this one i just saw it um when i was going when i went to the beauty supply store i wanted to buy a bunch of um hair gel for braiding hair and i wanted to just give each product a try so i bought different types but i haven't actually used this one but i have touched it just to feel the consistency this one has more of a creamy creamy consistency see that it has more of a creamy consistency i don't know if this can hold anything um i think this is best for like you know when you're braiding hair or twisting hair and you just want to keep your hands uh moisturized i would probably use this for that or maybe for locks for for people who has like re locks you can you can use this it does says it holds braids cornrows twist tighter so i guess you know you can use it for um cornrows um for twist you know when you, you need something to hold on to you, you need to um moisturize your your hands when you're twisting i guess you can use this i wouldn't use this for like edge control or like single braids i wouldn't use this next this is another popular one shine 
Oh, I forgot to show you the, the name. This is a product for the other one, the creamy one. Um, it's called the Mure Cream Beeswax. Mm, that's that. So next I have the Shine and Jam. This is one of the popular ones on YouTube. Um, this one is another good one for doing single braids. Um, you can also use this as edge control as well. Um, it doesn't leave white cast. I think I've used it, have I? I've used it for edge control. So far it doesn't leave white cast. But when I use it for single braid, I'll let you know. Or you can buy it and try it out. Um, it has clear color, so I, I would like to think that it wouldn't leave white cast. Um, and it's one of the popular ones on YouTube. Shine and jam. So this is another shine and jam. I told you I bought I bought a bunch of gel, a bunch of hair care stuff because I'm getting into making my hair again and I'm loving it. So I I want to have products handy for whenever I have you know the energy to do my hair. So this is another shine and jam, but this one is the conditioning gel and this one is for braiders i don't know you know the difference per se because this is also clear um i think i've also used this for like you know edge control um i haven't done many hairstyles since i bought this product um, when I use it for single braids, I guess I guess maybe I will do an updated um, version of this video. If you want an updated version of this video, please leave a comment below. But yeah, I don't see what the difference is. They are both clear and they both do similar jobs. This is con conditioning gel, su supreme hold. And this one is for braiders, extra firm hold, clean parts, control freeze, no build up. I think they do similar jobs. See, this one has olive oil as well, no alcohol, has shine, no pet petroleum with silk protein, non greasy conditioning, no wax. So, I mean, they have similar claim. So I guess whichever one is cheaper, you can go for it. I don't remember how much I bought these products. I would tell you, but I don't remember how much I bought them. Um, getting tired now, but we'll keep going. This one, this one is funny how I ended up with this one. It's called the Extreme. Pro S part. This is this reminds me of like the hair gel we use back home for the hairstyle we call packing gel. It's pretty much ponytail. This is like you know very light, doesn't do much. Um, when I went to the beauty supply store, I saw a lady. She was picking this up. She said she uses it for her daughter and. And it's really nice. She recommended it to me, so I picked it up. I bought the small size just in case. Um, I don't know. This is light, so I don't know if this can hold anything, if you can use this for edge control, but I guess you can use this for ponytail. You can use this for maybe braiding hair, to slick your hair down, I guess. Um, this one is not on my favorite list, but yeah, I guess this one would do the same job as, as the got to be, they both have similar consistency, but got to be glue has stronger hold. Does that make sense? Yeah. Maybe this is good for kids. You know and another 
um, YouTube favorite is this one. This one, my husband, you know, went to beauty supply store for me. <laughs> yeah, I make that guy do a bunch of stuff for me sometimes. Um, if I was the one buying it, I wouldn't buy a big size, but he got big size and I'm happy he got a big size because I like this. I like the consistency. It's not too, it's, it's, it's a thick consistency and it's clear. And I find this is perfect for single braids. Um, I also use it for uh, edge con as an edge control sometimes, but I find mm, it leaves white cast when I use it as edge control. Like I get those flaky, white flaky things on my hair. So I don't like it as edge control, but I like it for, you know, braiding hair. And yeah, this is the name braid formula super hold conditioning gel this one is the same it has the same claim as this one this one is also conditioning gel but i find this has a thicker consistency and i've used it you can see i've started using it a lot i don't know if you can see it I've used quite a bit and I'm so happy that it's a big size. My absolute favorite, um, okay, let me give you a bit of story. I just started doing my hair again, okay? And that's why I bought a bunch of product. Um, how did I get back into doing my hair again? Sometime last year, yeah, it was December, I think. Um, we were planning to go to Vegas and I made an appointment with my hairstylist who lives over an hour from me. And so when it was, you know, the day of my appointment, it was raining, icy rain, and I just couldn't risk it. So I canceled the appointment and I decided to do my own hair and prior to that my hairstylist gave me this product because every time she would use this product it smells so good and it has like a, a lot of shine in my hair I absolutely absolutely love it like even now that there's no product in it it still smells good it smells like candy it smells like your favorite cookie so I absolutely love this one but unfortunately, um, I don't think I've tried to search for it in beauty supply store. They don't have it. She said um, she gets it from, you know, people from, from Jamaica. I found it on Amazon. I'm going to try and order it from Amazon. I tried to order it, but um, I was quite desperate for, you know, immediate something that can come to me the next day and this will probably take over a month to get to me because it's from jamaica it's from other country so um yeah if you know any beauty supply store that carries this product in toronto please let me know or in canada anyway in canada i could order it online um yeah this is my favorite my hairstylist gave it to me and it's all done i'm not throwing it away because i want to get another one and i don't want to have to forget the name but if you can get this anywhere i would recommend this one this one is my absolute favorite you can use it for braiding you can use it for um edge control you can use it for any hairstyle this is and it smells divine so yeah so we've come to this is 22 minutes already wow i've been talking for that long okay i think i'm getting better at talking <laughs> this is the end of this video um i hope you find the video useful um if you have any suggestions of 
the kind of video you would like me to do in regards to hair or if you want to just you know encourage me please leave me a comment i'm just starting out and i'm trying to stay consistent thank you so much for staying to the end of the video i will see you in my next one take care bye bye